Let's get started. Let's get this over with. Good. You'll find Decca at the North Barricade with the rest of our defenders. Okay. Strike true as the ten. I'll see you when this is done. Wait. Oh, so I, I'm involved in this. I'm actually going to fight. There's armor in that chest. Take it. It might prove useful. This one? Why do I have to pry it open if it's for me? Good. May it keep you safe. Purple gear? Oh. My god. That is a huge improvement. Alright, let me go to coils. Uh, agility damage increases damage dealt while falling. Is this how I do it? No. Um, edit weaves. There we go. So, oh, I don't have any. That's some doo doo. It's okay. Let me let's look at it real quick. I mean, it's okay, but it's better armor, so I guess I can't really complain. I suppose. This is a ceremony. We'll take more than courage to prevail. To this will be. Regala will come for the chief. Only question is no, when. No lander is going to earn this right. We celebrate skill oh, and courage. Do you have ceremony? Party? I'm just taking it all in. Everything that they're saying. This is interesting. Wait. Oh, I thought the map marker was over that dude's head. So are we okay. Are we gonna fight? The Karo's defenders should be at the end of the stretch. Go to the North Barricade. Who this? Oh, that's just a Tanakh soldier. It's not what I'm looking for. I gotta get up there. How do I get up there? Is there stairs? Or do I just jump up this way? Um. Okay, so that didn't... Oh, there's stairs right there. What am I doing? Okay. Let's try this again. Focus on the machines. Take them down. And Regala's forces become no different from our own. Yes, Chaplain. Watch each other's backs. Dismissed. Our soldiers are ready. They will defend the cool route from below. But from above. Not bad. Where did you get it? One of our squads ripped it off a fallen machine. The honor is yours. Regala may have her tricks, but you will show her our Okay. I'm assuming it's starting. It's starting. <laughs> the cool root is upon us. Our struggle demands new blood. New leaders! Release the quarry! Oh my god! Challengers! Approach! They're gonna get destroyed! All who take down a machine shall be named Marshal! Remember the ten! Strike from the air as they did! And seize your glory! <laughs> this 
This is cool. Wait, so what am I doing? I'm so confused about what I'm supposed to be doing here. So are we just defending the the thing? Hold them back. Defend the cool route. Yes. Die. Let's get the big one first. Do I have unlimited? Oh my god, it's a really big one coming. I gotta I gotta aim at this huge one. He's dead. I can't kill my own people, right? I hope not. Haha. Oh no! Ow! Crap! Oh, there's another one right here! Oh, snap! I gotta take this guy out. He keeps freaking blasting at me. Oh, I really thought that environment thing was gonna kill him. Come on, baby. Oh, it's a big guy. I don't even know where his weakness is, but I'm going to do whatever I can to defend him. You want some of this? Okay. Say hello, my little friend. I'm out. Please tell me there's another one. I already won. There can't be all of them. It won't be. We should have stayed up there with that gun. Oh my god, it entered. <laughs> that was targeted for sure. Oh, it's her! She looked like she sniffed a fart. Wow. Oh, he's dead. He dead. Oh, the stare down. That look dumb. <laughs> oh my god, it's a cobra. He did. Get to the weapon. If I can draw that thing close, open fire. That's not a worm! Oh! 
<laughs> Dude, I'm so not gonna survive this. Let me stand up! What kind of bullshit is this? My god, this guy is huge. Oh, I missed. I missed again. No, mommy! Get away from me, you hooligan! What is it doing? What's it doing? No! Oh, I picked it up too. Come on! I didn't really have a choice. I'm not gonna make it, guys. This is gonna be a wash. Uh-oh. Okay, I'm getting better. I'm getting a little better. My hands are sweaty AF though. Oh god, that hurt like a ball sack. I'm not gonna make it. I have no more... I gotta run. While I was doing all that, let me go ahead and grab all of this. Get up, Aloy. You take forever. That's not what I wanted to pick up, but okay. I hate this move, man. Oh, God, he moved. Line it up faster. Oh, he peed on me. While he's up there, let me. Oh, It's on like Donkey Kong. I mean, I think no! I 
God, how many times do I gotta shoot that middle thing? Daddy. Come on, snake. No! <laughs> oh! I'm pretty sure I just jumped over his head. I go, I did it! I got him down! Critical! I did it! First try! Before I do any of that, I really need heals. So I gotta do whatever I can to max my health right now. So I only got one out of ten. Uh, where are we at? There's a little treasure box right here. No medicinal stuff. Oh, I see one right here. That's perfect. And a little treasure chest. Crap, I think that's all I got. I think it's 4 out of 10. Oh wait, there's one right here. 5 out of 10. Better than nothing. But still, I wish I had like a surplus, you know? Can I loot this guy? Ooh. Let me see if I can officially edit my weaves. That's a no-go. Okay, so where am I going? How do I get out of here? Hey, some berries. <clears throat> oh, oh, I see. I'm using the disaster that the snake caused to climb up. The Slytherin or whatever it's called. Get to the chopper! I think it might be better to just ignore everyone and just gonna Um there's got to be a way up, right? Is this guy a bad guy? No, that's a good person. I don't see anything. Yeah, I don't see a way to climb up. I guess in the meantime, look at this person just hiding. Supposed to be a soldier, bro. Okay, there's got to be something over there. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, the chief is fighting her! She's not gonna be strong enough. What?! Press X to doubt.
I don't think it got her. Yeah, run away like a coward like you always do. She has some really built up anger. This isn't finished. I'll oh. be back with everything I have. And all who stand with Hakaro will be run red. He's a good fighter. At attention. You fought <coughs> well. Proved yourself against enemies both metal and flesh. I name you all, Marshal. Your first order is to secure the arena from any remaining rebels. Go. Hey, he's a good leader, man. I like this guy a lot. Both of these guys. <coughs> I should have finished with Dalva. But now she'll be back with more machines. Stronger than ever. I'll do what I can to help. No, you've done enough. Far more than our bargain called for. He's a good man. When we first met, you spoke of your true mission on which all depends. I wasn't certain if I believed you then. But I believe in you now. So leave me. And get to your task. What will you do? Tend to the wounds. What you need is there. Take it. Your deeds today will be remembered like those of the ten. Yeah, that was feel good. I like it. Let's see if Aloy learned out of it uh, anything out of that though. Seems like she did. <coughs> Oh snap. There's below. What was this place? There. That console. Come on, Aether. Time to go home. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master override activated. Restoring ether subordinate function to original code. Got it. Hey, we got ether. Now to get this back to Gaia. The visions of the world have changed. The words of the pen are not Okay, I just want to go ahead and scan that. All of the visions are changed. And this Okay, I think that's it. Whoops. Get in there. So we got ether. So I'm assuming now we just go back to Gaia. And install it. Because the last time... If I remember correctly. Gaia had said... That that... Capsule... Can only store one programming at a time. The White House. Come here. Hey, what's up? The visions throughout the grove are different now. And this one, it, it just appeared. Is this your doing? The visions have changed. That's the one that inspired Chief Hakaro. More testimony of the old ones. Hear now the words that reunited a people. Following the tragic events of the war, Anne Faraday, the chief architect of the reconciliation effort, addressed a nation in need of hope. If we look into the future, the lens of the recent past, our fears loom. Wars waged against machines, scarcity of food and water, Storms that drive us from our homes. But true courage means facing those fears with conviction instead of cynicism. 
leading the peacekeeping effort with these brave men and women, these marshals of the new Southwest, has strengthened my conviction that when we are united, we can overcome any threat. Join me. Join us in that conviction <laughs> as we strive for a nation and a world without want or war. Rest easy, troops. I love it. Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. But Hikaru needs you. Because of you, he has new marshals. And a rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. So I will stand with you on your mission. Give whatever is left of my life. It is what I choose. How can I say no to that? Zoe. She took help! There's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. <coughs> we'll do, Aloy. Go to the mountains, west of Plainsong. A friend of mine will meet you on the ascent. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours? Should be interesting. Easy? She has a boyfriend. Oh, I'm so happy she actually she actually took in help. Alright. I need to get Ether back to Gaia. Yes, we do. Did something to the other holograms too. Might be worth checking out. Wait, where am I going? I'm going this way. Oh, there's a side quest right there. Are any of these challengers worthy of the title? And victory buys a place in Legend. Oh, well, oh there's a couple of Side quests. I kind of want to. We held off for Gala once. I kind of want to just go back to Gaia, but. Aloy. I want to do this. Blood of the Ten, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. <laughs> we all just have to remember them then. <laughs> well, thanks to you. The chief still lives, and hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor, a personal one. My grandson, Kabul. He was not counted among the dead, which means he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner? No. He joined them willingly. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task, so my blade is alone in this. Unless you'd be willing to join me. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. But Kavo is the last of my blood. Uh, why would they join the rebels? What made Kavo join Regala's rebellion? For some, Regala represents a chance of vengeance against the Kaiza. During the Red Raids, it wasn't easy to turn the clans back at Baron Light. Many wanted to pursue the Kaiza all the way to Meridian. So when Regala attacked the embassy, they took it as a call to arms. Yes. But others, the young especially, <laughs> care only about the glory they think they'll earn by hunting an age-old enemy. And for Cabo, it was probably a bit of both. And a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing I said could stop him. Okay. Will he listen if I try to talk to him? So if Cabo didn't listen to you when he joined the rebels, what makes you think he will now? <coughs> Cabo was too young to fight during the Red Raids. Moore was a stranger to him. 
but he must have experienced the suffering it brings by now. He will listen. He must. I just have to find him before <laughs> it's too late. Yeah, it makes sense. The last of your blood? You said Cabo is your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans warred constantly with each other. Every skirmish claimed another comrade. One by one, I buried my children. And then, their children. I'm sorry. Yeah, damn. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield, but I never found comfort there. Only in the wisdom of the visions. And even so, I still couldn't prevent Cavo from following the trail of blood. So Hikaru will accept uh will Hikaru accept him back? If Cavo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. The rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. But you have to try. Yeah, it makes sense. I'll find your grandson. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive there. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Cavo's squad went. Shall we head out? So she's actually... Yeah, let's go now. Let's go. Good. This way. The outpost isn't <coughs> far. I'll get that other quest. Uh, you know what? Let me get this quest real quick. If it'll allow me. Okay, no, I'll get it when we come back. It's just one quest, I believe, anyways, right? You know... The rebels aren't going to give up without a fight. Then we'll have to give them one. The bloodshed won't end until Regala is defeated. It's honestly amazing how beautiful this game what is. What matters is the soldier they took captive, Nikala. She's been their prisoner for some time now. She's my only lead to finding Cabo. We'll get her back. And then Cabo too. For sure. I probably should do this. The outpost should be just ahead. Unknown rebel outpost, okay, 40 point. meters. I'll follow. Oh my god, they're on a freaking machine. I need... Heels. Luckily, there's a few just hanging around right here, right in the front. Leave them be, they'll cause nothing but trouble. I should lie low. Find whoever's in charge and take them out. Maybe then the rest will leave. Save these for when I need it. Okay, so I'm at 10. Let me see, hold on. What is this? Values, valuable box? Okay. What was that? Man, I gotta figure out how to take this guy out. Okay, before I go that way, I definitely gotta pick some of these berries up. So that I can make some more medicinal stuff should I run out of my immediate 10, you know? Let me grab this one and we'll call it a day for now. Another rebel outpost. I need to take out the leader. Aloy, I already know this. I'm gonna assume that the leader is actually the dude that's on that giant robot. Or machine, excuse me. I'm a little nervous, not gonna lie. It's actually very quiet here. Is 
there anybody up here? Grapple point? Oh, he's coming back. You know, this is a good spot for an ambush. Can I do any leveling? Skills, I have four? How do I activate this, man? I always forget. Skill info. Activate the selected Valor Surge by opening the weapon wheel, L1, and tapping R1. Whoops, I still need a... So I can learn this skill. Got the first... Okay. We'll call it that for now. Oh, that's her. I was like, what is going on? Get in here! That has to be the leader. Ready? What? Shoot him in the ass. We strike together. Let's go. One down. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? That hurt. Screw you. Oh, crap. You want some of this, buddy? You want some of this? Okay. Say hello, my little friend. Oh, God, there's more. Where are they? I don't know. I hear them. They're on the far side, though. I don't think they actually see us. They don't. <clears throat> Come now. Face my blade. Don't start no shit right now. They think they're safe in the grass. Prove them wrong. Tag target. It's just a suspended platform. Who the hell is- Oh. What? Oh. Tag team, baby. Let's go. So much for the tag team. Oh, he- Screw you, buddy. Oh, that should have got him. That one definitely did. Let's go ahead and... Grab all of our stuff real quick. They're shooting at us. There's one right there. Come on. Oh! Weak spot, you don't say. Oh, come on. Dunzo. <clears throat> oh, there's a... There's a big boss man right there. I want to get him with a critical. Gotta finish it. Come here, 
buddy. He doesn't even stand a chance. Ooh, smart of you to go back there. Ah! Will you just die? Thank you. Definitely don't run. Oh, 12 berries. That gave me 12 berries. This has to be the leader, right? Highlight track. We'll take <gasps> If I could... Actually, you know what? I don't know if I want to hit him with a bomb or with a critical. I think I'm just going to hit him with a critical. Right here. All of our enemies will be put to the sword. Blood will run through the west. Silent Strike! That's all of them. Our scouts said they saw Nakala tied up at a wood post. Let's look around. Wood post. If I had to guess, it's probably somewhere in the middle. There. That's the post. Here? No, Nakala, obviously. But maybe the rebels moved her. I can look for tracks. That was it. Come, Aloy. Back to the task at hand. What do you think I'm doing? Can you relax? Hmm. I might I'm... be able to find Nicola's tracks with my focus. Okay, I will. Just give me one second, dude. There's a lot of berries and in... oh my god, the berries. Still not cooling off. Rebel Rider. Those are all dead guys. There. Tracks leading away from the post. Where do they go? South, apparently. I got oh. berries for days. I'm excited for that. Or Hold on. Okay, I don't know. Let's examine the blood. <clears throat> Blood's dried. Someone was wounded here a while ago. But not fatally. <clears throat> this is where we killed that home go that uh homeboy. I have fifty tucked away in my stash too. What's this right here? Dead end. No. I think there's something under that wood. Oh, snap. It's true. Take my hand, Nicola. <gasps> Steady now. <coughs> Where am I? Chaplain? Is that you? And with an outlander. Whoa. How'd you end up down there? Tribbles had me strung up. They thought I'd give up intel about lowland squad movements by letting me bake in the sun. Managed to slip my bonds and make a run for it. They made me pay for that. Last thing I remember was a crack on the head and the taste of dirt. How'd you end up here? We're looking for Cavo. His squad was last spotted leaving this outpost. Yeah, he was here. It was his squad that attacked us on the road. My comrades got away, but I was taken. Cabo tied me to the post himself. If you're looking for him, Chaplain, I'm afraid you'll only find a dead end. His loyalties are clear. Do you know where his squad went? I overheard them mention Fall's Edge. Then we'll... we'll pick the search up from there. 
I'll go ahead and meet you at Fall's Edge, southwest of here. Decca, if Cabo attacked her squad? No. He's not lost to us yet. We have to find him and turn him from this path. <sighs> okay. I'll see you there. I don't know. It's getting a little shifty. That wound needs to be looked at. It'll scar. I just need to rest a bit. Then I'll report into the grove. I'm telling you, <coughs> here. The chaplain might not want to hear it, but her grandson is a traitor. I guess we'll see about that. Damn. She definitely might not want to hear about that. It's... I hope it's not too far. It's a little far. A lot of jumping in this one. I mean, I guess it's not too far. It goes by quick once you start... Running. What am I stuck on? Sprint, Aloy, let's go! <clears throat> it's pretty cool that we were able to take out the, uh... The leader of that one camp by one... By literally just a one-shot kill. What was that? That was pretty cool. Uh oh. Oh god, I remember those. I'm just running. I don't want to fight him. Zigzag. I think we got this. I think we're gone, actually. Yeah, we're already over halfway there. Thank God for the glider. We're gonna land in the water though, unfortunately. It's okay, Alo. You needed a, uh, you needed a shower, anyways. It's been a few days. <clears throat> Wherever it is we're going, we're already there, or practically there. This was far, though. <clears throat> Where is it on the map? <laughs> okay. The good thing is that we can always fast travel back to Gaia anyway, so that should be pretty simple right off the bat. Looks like I could use some Ridgewood. Oh, not anymore. Let's go. Okay. We're golden. I was trying not to get wet. Like I should be waiting for me in there. So these are good, these are good people? Yeah, Tanakh guard, okay, got it. All right, who am I talking to? Well, I know who I'm talking to, but where is she? I'm telling the truth. Listen to him, Aroke. Not a chance. He's a traitor. Oh, snap. Oops, wrong button. Decca, what's going on? Aloy, I'm glad you're here. This is Aroke, leader of Fall's Edge. So you've enlisted the Chief's champion in your dull-bladed efforts. You must be Cavo, then. My grandson. And a soldier trying to right his mistakes. Or trying to lure us into a trap. My scouts caught him, sneaking around on the outskirts of the village. I wasn't sneaking around. I was coming to warn you. The rebels are planning an attack. They're going to send a machine straight through this village. 
I left my post when I realized what they were planning. You have to believe me. Where are the rebels now? They were hunting for the machine north of here. I, I can show you the way. The only thing you'll do is face trial by combat. You betrayed your clan. Your chief. Blood and blades will decide your fate. I'll fight whoever you want. After we stop the attack. Uh, attack on False Edge. Why destroy <coughs> this village? I thought Regala's fight was with Hikaro. Hikaro was a lowlander before he was chief. Unlike the Desert and Sky clans. We stand behind him without question. Falls Edge is a strategic midpoint between the Grove and our capital on the coast. It's true. Our orders were to cut off Hikaro's support from the Lowland clan. But I thought that meant disrupting supply routes, not slaughtering an entire village. Who's that other guy? Deserting Regala's uh, rebels. You said you defected after you found out about the attack. Why'd you change your mind? When I joined the rebels, I thought Regala was going to lead us into battle against our old enemy, the Karja. But all we've done is kill each other. And for what? Pride? Vengeance? So when my squad leader told us about the mission to destroy this village, I left my post. Don't believe his lies. Anyone who deserted the tribe to join Regala knew exactly what they were getting themselves into. Not everyone. Okay, stop the rebels. Is telling the truth. This whole village is in danger. <laughs> we have to find and stop these rebels. The rebels built a campfire north of the river, near the cliffs. I can show you the way from there. Okay. Open it up, or okay? No. I won't give him the chance to escape. The traitor stays here until his trial by combat. Then I invoke blood for blood. I will take Cavo's place until he returns. You're making a mistake, Chaplain. The clan needs your guidance, not the lies of this bare-armed boy. The right has been called. Cavo will go with Aloy. Then I'm going to. If the boy speaks truth, you'll need my blade. If he lies, I'll run him through. I must make that's, arrangements that's here fair. first. Then I'll bring the boy to the meeting place. Fine. I'll see you there. Well, she really believes in this guy if she's invoked blood for blood. Sounds sounds actually pretty cool. <clears throat> I don't want to greet a Tanakh soldier. How far is it? I hope it's not that far. It's not. Okay, good. I was about to say, did I discover this way? Sh uh, not the way shrine. <laughs> I've been playing ESO too much, apparently. Uh, campfire, but yes, I did. The campfire that Cavo mentioned should be nearby. What's taking so long? They should be here already. I'm so coming. Ahead. Rebels. Friends of Cavo's. I'm going to have to take them out to get to that campfire. Is that it? Just three of them? All clear. Okay, so how am I gonna do this? This person needs to turn around. It's a female, but there we go. Gold ingot. See that? Halt, Outlander! That's not the one I wanted to sign the strike! No! You know, these these work very well against him. Ooh! 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 Oh come on! What the hell am I stuck on? Uh, uh. 
Oh god, dude, this dude is fucking fast. Fight the other way, god damn it! So the good thing is, there's some purple here. A couple of purple here. I will take it. Let me go ahead and take that. Max out my stuff. My health. Whoops. Man, I'm getting a lot of purple stuff. What I need, though, is medicinal. Do I have to activate this? Okay, yeah. There we go. Found a few of your friends when I got here, Cavo. You're not off to a great start. You have some explaining to do. I swear on the ten, I didn't know they'd be here. What did I tell you? His lies are an open sore. Better we cauterize it now than let it fester. <coughs> no! I'm telling the truth! Untie him. As you say. But this is a mistake. We could both easily Can off him. Weapon? If you think... Just give it to him, or okay? We need to get moving. He'd be easy to off anyway, so... Lead the way. God, he better not be fucking lying. I don't care if he's the grandson of the chaplain. I'd Up off the way. hell out of him. They We're beat me. Us. The rebels are stationed at the nearby cliff falls. I took this path when I left my post. The others won't be expecting anyone to come this way. Or they are, and will be skewered the moment we arrive. I hope not. I want a good ending for this kid, but... There's the cliff falls. And there's no one there, as I suspected. Let's just keep going. I don't like this. Wait, what's going on? Well, I'm just gonna go and beat them to it. Screw it. Since I'm the better climber anyways. My god, Aloy, hurry up. Is everyone? No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there, by the falls. Blood of the ten. If that thing runs through Falls Edge, the village stands no chance. Then we stop them. Right here. On your lead, Aloy. Crap. Will stand in our way now. Grab your gear. We march on Falls Edge. I didn't want these. Where'd you come? I found them. Oh. Fuck. Right Attack. Why did I have the poison one equipped? It? Oh, what? Get up! Oh. 
What am I doing? I am fighting horribly. Big mistake. At this point, honestly, I think it's better to just reset. Where are these freaking losers? Yeah, it's okay. Oh, that was horrible. That was, that was just, that was just bad. Is everyone? No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there, by the falls. Where's the guy at? Right off that tent. If that thing runs through Falls Edge, the village stands no chance. Then we stop them. Right here. On your lead, Aloy. <laughs> Nothing will stand in our way now! <laughs> I can't believe two shots didn't kill her. What was that? Whatever it was, one shot at me. Where is everyone? No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there, by the falls. If that thing runs through Falls Edge, the village stands no chance. Then we stop them. Right here. Nothing will stand in our way now! Grab your gear. We march on Falls Edge. I gotta chill. I'm gonna systematically try to take out all of these guys first. Before I take out the big guy. Let me see if there's anybody else I haven't selected. Yep, okay. Oh, snap! He's coming this way. That's not good. We're golden. I don't know where he is. Oh, I saw you. This dude's pretty much dead. Oh, get up! Oh, I'm dead. So this is gonna be a tough fight for sure. I can't get caught, that's the thing. No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there. Thing runs through Falls Edge. 
shoot at the fire. Stands no chance. And I'll stop them. Right here. On your lead, Aloy. Nothing will stand in our way now! Grab your gear. We march on Fall's Edge. Why does it keep switching freaking weapons on me? It's so annoying. I'll come back for her. She's a little risky anyways. I think I could take this guy out. I think I could take her out, actually. What's the car without his marshals? Nothing. What have you found? Okay. Oh no. Stay quiet. I'm not gonna loot, I'm running. Stay away from me. Okay, I think we're good. It's so dark, I can't tell if it's a headshot. It was too dark. What? God, this game is so frustrating sometimes. Okay. Can't see. Okay, so far so good. Get up in there. Oh! Keep it going. Fuck! He's dead. Oh, come on, that one should have killed her. Boy, well, she's dead. Oh my god, talk about a perfect timing. Juke. Is there only one guy left? Yep, one guy left. Let me go take out homeboy. Where is he? Oh, he's right there. Get away from me! That was a freaking hardcore fail. Where is this guy again? Is she dead? Yeah, she died. Fuck. 
Why isn't it working? Those traps are freaking useless right now. Get out of the way! I just did that to myself. <laughs> Stop spitting dirt at me. Oh, fuck. Get out of the fucking way! Run! <laughs> I'm so scared. Sorry for my cussing, guys. I'm scared. I mean, he's kind of almost dead. Time out. How can he shoot me through the wall? Oh, he's about to blow up. <laughs> it worked. It. it worked. Hey, more purple. Anything I could use? Of course not. You're bleeding. I'll be fine. What matters is the attack was stopped because of your warning. You saved many lives today. Come on. Let's get you back to Falls Edge. Uh, I guess I cracked some rims, too. Go on ahead. <coughs> See him back to the village. Okay. I'll let Decca know what happened. <coughs> you know. I get that they want to tell a feel-good story and everything, but low-key, I kind of wish that they, um, they actually had an actual traitor story. Like, we gave them the benefit of the doubt, but they were still a traitor. You know what I mean? Thank God for the gliding. All right, it shouldn't be too far, right? Oh, that scared the hell out of me. Could we just fast travel from here? Uh, fast travel for free. Yes, we can. No, it's not what I wanted. Travel. There we go. Let's, let's make it easy on ourselves. It's up here, right? 
it wasn't up here, it's below. We'll find it, eventually. There it is. Three leave, only you return? What happened? Cabo was telling the truth. The rebels had a behemoth. Cabo was injured in the battle, but we stopped the attack. Aroke... Regrets that he doubted the boy. Your grandson proved himself to be honest and brave, Chaplain. He's loyal to the lowland. So you'll release him? He's earned his freedom. But it'll take many more deeds to earn back the rest of the clan's trust. I'll do whatever it takes. Good. Good for you. She should slap the hell out of him. Thank you, Eloy. <clears throat> Indeed. Falls Edge owes you a great debt. May this begin to repay it. Thank you. As soon as you're healed, I have so much to show you. Welcome back, Cabo. <laughs> nice. Let's make our way back to the, um, to the campfire. Okay, that's fine. Let's go. So now we go back to Gaia, right? Where's Gaia? Is this Gaia? That's not what I wanted. Travel. There we go. Oh, I totally forgot there was another quest that we were supposed to be doing, wasn't there? Oopsie daisy. Oh, well, we'll do that afterwards. Let's turn this in for now. How do I get up there? I figured it'd start down soon. At least there's an easy way up. The base. Here goes. The second like programming. Oh, uh, you're not waving a hammer around, Aaron. It's Aaron. Gentler touch. And my big sausage fingers don't really do gentle, okay? Bring it back. Trace the line. To your right. Other right. <laughs> I just saw it. It's the one Aloy found up north. Gotcha. They call it a, a concussion beat party or something. And yeah, now that's music. Aloy! Errand. Oh my better. god. And you're here. Well, the world only goes on. If you can do your thing, we learn fast enough, we help make that happen. You want all the backup you can get, right? We still have much training to do, of course. <coughs> One does not become hunter in a day. Each seed grows at a pace of its own. Doesn't mean it won't bloom. You should know your Tanakh friend arrived. Yay! I heard their warriors drink people's blood. I want to sleep with one eye open. He's a good guy, I man. I've seen enough blood for a lifetime. I showed him to one of the rooms. <laughs> he seems to appreciate the privacy. Uh, looks like you've got things under control. I should get this to Gaia. Right. We'll keep on training. Catch up as fast as we can. I'm seeing glyphs in my dreams already. <laughs> well, while you've been off gallivanting around, I've been working with Gaia to find out more about the land gods. So, from where I'm standing, you're in need of some training. Come along. Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> oh. 
and I delivered your message to Talana. She headed for that Asaram camp you two were looking for, to the southwest. So the old ones painted their faces with something called makeup. Like a <laughs> Why? So stupid. <laughs> okay, let's go. That was funny. Makeup. <laughs> Hi, Gaia. Long time no see. Please merge ether with me. Afterwards, I must discuss an important matter with you. Okay. I wonder what she has to talk to us about. <coughs> so, what did you want to discuss? While you were away, I received an unusual transmission on my dedicated Aluthia frequency. Aluthia? That's one of the sub-functions you couldn't detect before. Yes. The transmission occurred so slowly that at first it seemed like an accidental blip of data amongst background static. Once I noticed this irregularity, it took some time to collate the complete message. Beware? <coughs> Where does it lead? To a mountain to the northwest of this facility. A word of caution, Aloy. It is possible this transmission is genuine. It is also possible it is being broadcast by someone or something else. You don't think it's actually Aluthia? I am uncertain. What's SOS? Save our it souls. Is an old world code. A distress signal. A desperate plea for help. Uh, Eleuthia. Why would Eleuthia send a coded transmission on a frequency only the two of you can communicate on? I believe it was done as a precaution to avoid detection. Or at least to create the appearance of the desire to do so. I am also uncertain why Eleuthia would expect that I would be able to detect and respond to its distress signal at all. As far as it is aware, I no longer function. Okay, so either Aluthia <clears throat> is in trouble and sent the message hoping you were out there, or someone else is trying to get us to go to these coordinates pretending to be Aluthia. That is my conclusion as well. It could be Aloy 2.0. Uh, could it be the Zethans? The, the Zenithan? The Zeniths? Whatever. I forget, I forget how to say their name. Could the Zeniths be sending the Zenith. transmission? According to the data I reviewed on your focus, the Zeniths recovered the other Gaia root kernel in the Hades Proving Lab. Bum bum bum. It's feasible they used it to gain access to my internal frequencies. So, maybe they sent it thinking you'd respond and reveal your location. Possibly. However, the transmission is highly irregular. If they intended to provoke me into revealing myself, I would expect the communication to be more routine. Right. So <laughs> maybe it's not them, then. I mean, it could still be. Maybe they expected her to expect that in particular, so they went with a different route in general. Always a possibility, you know? But anyways, about the transmission. You said the coordinates lead to a mountain to the northwest. What's there? I have no record of anything of note in that vicinity. Okay, and what about the other number in the message? 237. Any idea what that means? I have queried my available databases, but it does not appear to have any significance. Perhaps its meaning can only be understood at the indicated coordinates. That's... I'll investigate. All right. I'll go to the coordinates and check out the source of the transmission. All by yourself? Ha! No way. I included Erend and Varl in this briefing via their focuses. I concur that you should not investigate this alone. What if it's a trap? Of course it could be a trap. Come on, Aloy, but give me some hope. If it is Eleuthia, then it's in trouble, and I need to bring it back. Don't worry. 
I'll be careful and... We're coming with you. Fine. Go grab your things. Why does she always make it seem... Exit, in case you need to upgrade your gear. Like, I'll give it to her. She's making progress, but someone offers you help in a situation where you could potentially get killed. And she's like, fine. She sounds like they are the hindrance, you know? It's kind of, uh, weird. Where is this anyways? Quest. Well, I guess it's still in here. Talk to Varl. To know. I'll check it out when I can. Okay, first things first, I need to talk to Varl. <laughs> there she is. You ready to head out? Uh. Yeah, sure, let's get. Uh, yeah, let's get going. Let's go. Look at us. Three battle hardened badasses forging into the unknown. This ought to be good. This distress call had to be up a really steep mountain, huh? Uh oh, spaghettios. That hurt her. That hurt them. Well, that takes the keg. It's one of the zeniths again. But what's going on? Burl, see if there's anything over there. On it. We'll check out the battlefield. Let's start with that zenith. Yeah, the zenith oh, is where I would start. About. <clears throat> Can't believe you fought one of them. Almost didn't make it. Oh, she's dead! Whatever the rebels did, it took down her shield. But why was she here? I can access her last communication file, but I'll use my focus to scan the battlefield, too. What about that crazy weapon the Zenith had? It looked like she can make it come and go at will. But it's gone now. Yeah. Well, go do your thing. I'll wait here. Okay. So I can't search these guys? I can feel this frost down to my bones. The Spectre had instructions to assist recovery of the asset. I wonder what this asset is. Hmm. Whoops. Anything else? What a mess. Is that Varl? Hey, he's all the way down there. <laughs> Honestly, I probably do have to go in that direction, but... I don't see anything else. Wait. The weapon. Man, really? I can't pick that up right now? That's some bogus... Instructions. An Oceron with a focus. 
Looks like he was sending data on the weapons somewhere else. Interesting. Now the weapon. Ah. Ah. The weapon's still hot. I need to know how it worked. But I'll have to check on it once it's cooled off. Okay, so that was a fail. Let's take a quick look around. Camp gear. Is this where they stayed? Looks like the rebels camped here for a while. Are they watching this area? All right. I think I have an idea what happened here. I better get back to Erend. Erend. I figured it out. I I guess. All right, she who sees the unseen. What did you find out? This was a carefully planned attack. I found camping gear up there. The rebels must have been staking out this place for at least a few days. They were waiting for the Zeniths to show up. All so that they could test that weapon. The Zeniths have a personal shield that makes them invulnerable, but somehow the weapon got rid of it. The Osirum that was operating it was sending data on it somewhere else. It was probably just a prototype. I've known tinkers that do that. I'd do a little trial run before breaking out the real thing. Well, I guess it's still a work in progress. If it blew up. She was searching for something she lost. Her drone had instructions to recover something called the asset. The asset? Is that the uh, sub-function thing that you said could be here? The Luthia? I'm not sure. Could be. Come on, let's go talk to Varl. But I'm not 100% sure, to be honest. We don't have enough information. Maybe Varl's found something. Varl? Oh, he definitely found something, all right. <clears throat> That's a long way down. Something tunneled straight down into the mountain. Looks recent. Whatever it was, it must have been powerful. That zenith the rebels killed was looking for something called... The Asset. I don't know what it is, but my guess is it's somewhere down there. All right, so we head down. Erend, stay here and stand watch. That zenith isn't the only one of its kind. I don't want to be caught by surprise if the others show up. Contact us by focus if you see anything. Okay. If any trouble shows up, I'll call you. Let's go. Down into the depths we go. There's some kind of old world ruin down here. You said the Zeniths have their own backup of Gaia, right? Yeah, from the Proving Lab. So maybe they were after Eleuthia. Found its hiding spot, so it sent the distress signal. Maybe. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go this way. Looks like some kind of data center. I might be able to access the facility systems from that console. Let's do that then. What is this thing? Oh, is this what set the transmission? I've never seen a transmitter like this before. Looks like it's self-destructed. Looks like Zenith technology. This was a four Zenith research lab. It looks like a lot of data was beamcast from here recently. From that device nearby. So Eleuthia is gone? If it was ever here, then probably. But then why were the Zenith still searching for the asset? Let's keep looking around. <clears throat> okay. The whole story with the Zenith is kind of interesting. So, exploring another far Zenith ruin. At least this one doesn't seem to have giant killer machines. Or anything you can blow up. 
Hmm. What do we have here? Let's take a quick peek around here. Just in case. Oh, this is locked. Can't be going through there. So I guess the only location is this way. It's on going. This place is huge. Some kind of storage room, maybe. Maybe the asset is in here somewhere. If it is, somehow the Zenith couldn't find it. Let's look around. The control what... console to access the storage units. Can it tell us if the asset is in one of them? Well, let's find out. Where? Yeah, I thought it was this thing. <clears throat> 236 containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. 236? Wasn't there a number in the distress signal? You're right. I should check the log. I hate doing this. Uh, data points. Um. I don't want no voice memos. It's gotta be one of the written ones, right? Um No two thirty seven two thirty seven two hundred and thirty six containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. There's 236, but the number's 237? That's interesting. It's a body. It's a little me. Aloy. It's you. Skin's like ice. Must have cut this from her head. But why? Alive. We need to get her back to. Oh shit, they can fly. Aloy. Aloy, can, can you hear me through this thing? What's going on, Aaron? Two of those spectre things just fell out of the sky. One of them is heading down towards you, the other one's waiting up here. We're coming up. Stay in cover until I get there. You got it. Are we gonna get her out of here? Whatever happens, she stays with us. 
I'll protect her. Good. Now there's two Aloys. The Spectre gets here. I can't let it get through to Voral and the clone. How do I do that? I'm assuming just by getting supplies. Here it comes. Did it? Oh crap! Ooh, Okay. Let's go. Come and get me, bad boy. I should scan that thing. See if it has anything else. Ugh! Scanning this thing. Oh, that thing's quick. little guy it wasn't a perfect oh, I try to get out of the way did it not work it did now Ooh! mom help me Can I craft these? Ooh, that hurt. Come up here. No, not these. No! Oh, I get terrified by these. Come and get me, buddy. Where is he? Oh, fuck. <clears throat> Come here. Come here, little guy. Well, I got him. This guy is so tanky. What I need to do... Is craft some more traps. Oh! I got acid traps though. Let me go back up here. Can you like pause for a second? Where you at? I don't think you can get me from here. He's gonna hit the acid trap. Where is he? Ooh! He hit the acid trap. Oh! Oh, crap. At least we got him. We're good, we're good, we're good. 
That acid is really messing him up. I need him to come over here though. Because I want him to take another hit. Come here, take another hit of the acid. That was perfect timing, to be honest. Oh. Oh. Oh, come on, I juke that. Nice try there, buddy. Got him. There. Are you okay, Aloy? Yeah, I'm heading up top. Stay down here with the clone for now. Got we it. got one more to I'll fight. Once the coast is clear. We should top off this too. I kind of feel bad because Varl's gonna have to literally carry Aloy 2.0. All the way up the, the shaft all by himself. Gotta get back up top and deal with that other specter. I just hope Aaron stays in cover. <laughs> For some reason, I don't think he will. Where am I? I don't think this is where I need to be. Okay, yeah, I think I figured it out. The good thing is that it's gonna be me and uh, Aaron. Aaron. Speak of the devil. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Just hurry. I'm literally here, buddy. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I gotta get to Aaron. Had enough supplies. These worked last time, so I'm definitely gonna craft them. That acid really messed them up. Aaron, I'm here. Watch out. That thing's shooting down the center. Stay put. I'll see what I can do. The second you need me, I'm there. Shields down. It's on the that, move. That's it? Get your back, Aloy. He still doesn't even see me. Did the acid get him? <laughs> I could use it against the Spectre. Use what against the Spectre? What am I using against them? I'm so confused. Oh! 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 What? God, that hurt. You don't see anything. Fuck! This one's smarter than the other one. Yeah, I'm all right. Hey, 
Watch this. Idiot beats hammer. Kaboom. That worked. Whoa! Did I miss? No. Did that one miss? No. Those are powerful. Let's go! Woo! Nice. <clears throat> Aloy 2.0. I swear I'm not drunk, but right now she's double. <laughs> Long story, but it'll have to wait. She needs a healer, but we need to get her back to the base immediately. Right. Yeah. Well, what are we waiting for then? You two go on ahead. I need to take another look at that weapon. Yeah, now that it's cool. I can figure out how that thing works. Maybe the Zenas won't be so invincible after all. Let me try to loot this guy first. Good idea. World always seems quieter when it's okay. Four is better than nothing. Let's see what she says about this thing now. That's a fail. Well, it's better than nothing. Back to the camp, I guess? I need to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. Okay. If we can replicate it, maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zenus. I should check on the clone, too. Burl, where's our guest? We're in the maintenance corridor below the control run. Okay. Aloy. Okay, here. Glad you made it back okay. She panicked after waking up and stumbled down here. <coughs> I thought it best to wait for you. I'll talk to her. Hey, this is Aloy Wimp 1.0. Hello? It's, uh... It's Beta, right? My name's Aloy. What's wrong? Is it your injury? Simulacrum withdrawal syndrome. I don't understand. Sudden removal of a neurologically integrated data device. The brain, especially the cerebellum, goes into a kind of sensory freefall. Everything real feels unreal, distant. Is there anything that can help? Do you have a focus to spare? It's it's primitive, but I can make it work. Yeah. I had a whole bag full of them. Not really sure where I got them from, though. Booting up. So, uh, hey, boy. I suppose you want information. About you and the Zeniths? Yeah. Why are they here? What do they want? How did they get you? But let's start at the beginning. I'm guessing they faked the destruction of their ship a thousand years ago? That seems consistent with their behavior. They wouldn't want to be followed. So far, Zenith established a colony world after all. Yes, <sighs> for a few hundred years, but it didn't last. Some sort of natural disaster rendered it uninhabitable. Okay, so... The descendants of Far Zenith escaped a dying planet, and now they want to claim Earth for themselves? Not their descendants. What? Not their descendants. It, it, it's them. 
The same ones who left Earth a thousand years ago. You didn't How's... know? How can they still be alive? They don't even look... What did they do to themselves? I believe it's a combination of pharmaceutical, cellular treatments, and technological implants. And, and you? Does that mean that you are... I'm not like them. I was <coughs> made. On the way to Earth. On the ship. I spent years studying in my training interface. All so that I could serve my function. Access and control of the terraforming system. But why? What do the Zeniths want with it? When I discovered the Zero Dawn system had disseminated into its subcomponents, I thought my purpose was to fix it. But I don't think the Zeniths want that at all. I think they want to wipe Earth clean and start over. That would have surprised me, to be honest. Zeniths plan for Earth. So the Zeniths want to exterminate life on Earth. That's what Guy and I concluded, too. But why? Why kill everyone just to take over? When they took me on missions with them, I saw how they butchered the tribal people we encountered. They didn't seem to care about a rejuvenated Earth, so I concluded that they must want a hard reboot of the system. Then they can redesign it to be exactly what they want. Mass extinction for their own comfort? Who thinks like that? Well, without their Gaia kernel, they'll have a hard time doing that. What's your uh, role in the Zenith plan? The Zeniths needed Elizabeth's gene prints to access Zero Dawn facilities. So they made you. Trained you. And you went along with it? They told me I was born to interface with the Zero Dawn system. When we reached Earth, I pieced together what must have happened to Gaia and her subordinate functions. That's when I started to realize I wasn't meant to fix Gaia. That they must have made me so I could do what their remote extinction signal failed to do. Reboot Earth for their own benefit. Wow, extinction signal. So you know about the extinction signal. It was speculation, but the only logical conclusion why Gaia suddenly self-destructed after operating efficiently for centuries. Gaia would have only undertaken such a desperate course of action if it had detected a threat to life on Earth that was more dangerous than ceasing <laughs> function altogether. I should have realized that she would also order the recreation of Elizabeth Sobek to rebuild her. Yeah, well, surprise. <laughs> okay, about the Zeniths. So we're dealing with the same far Zenith people who once lived on Earth. What else do you know about them? They were some of the most affluent and powerful people on Earth. They controlled almost every major resource, every industry. Gerard commands them. He's the one who decided to set up a base. The others, Eric, Tilda, Verbena, they resent his authority over them, but in the end, they always do what he says. Of course. Eric, he's the one I fought back in the Hades Proving Lab. He enjoys hurting people. Yeah, I know. A uh, Zenith base? You mentioned the Zenith set up a base here on Earth. Where is it? Off the coast, I think. Whenever I had to go on missions, I was transported inside of a Spectre drone. I couldn't see anything outside. But I did overhear the Zeniths talking about it once. They were discussing setting up a perimeter energy shield to repel the local fauna. I'm certain they have other security measures. Spectre patrols, machine wars. It, it must be impregnable. What's inside the base? Launch facilities so they can shuttle back and forth to their ship in orbit. Plus infrastructure to gather materials and fabricate anything they need. Are there more Zeniths than the ones you met? Uh, I'm not sure. I, I suppose there must be more of them in the base or back on the ship. For all I know, there could be more of them out in space. Other survivors of the colony. Zenith colony. You said the Zenith colony in the Sirius system was destroyed. What happened? All I was ever told was that a natural disaster forced them to leave Sirius. I've speculated that it was an extrasolar object or a cataclysmic seismic event. Or maybe even an abnormally violent coronal mass ejection from Sirius A. The Zeniths never told you any details. They said the only thing that mattered was that they survived. First Earth, a thousand years ago, and then Sirius. Guess they survived old age too. Uh, your escape? How did you escape the Zeniths? Before the Hades Proving Lab, I never thought I'd get away from them. Even if I were to run, 
I'd never survive on my own in the wilds. But then I saw you. And I thought that maybe you could help me. So when the Zeniths pinpointed Eleuthia's location in the biomedical research facility, I saw an opportunity. Opportunity to escape? You said you saw an opportunity to escape when you went to capture Eleuthia. What did you do, exactly? Whenever I was taken out on a mission to recover a subordinate function, only one of the Zeniths would go with me. The one the rebels killed, outside the facility. But Bainus dead? How did they bypass her shield? I'm looking into it. But you were talking about your escape? Well, when it was time to use the Zenith's transmitter to send Eleuthia back to base, I also sent the encrypted transmission. Then I distracted Verbena long enough to seal myself in the ectogenic chamber, altering the facility's log so it appeared that there were only 236 containers. Makes sense. From the Gaia root kernel, I told them I could capture Eleuthia faster if I had it with me, and they believed me. Well done. Uh, your origins. You said you were born on the way to Earth. In an artificial womb, I'm guessing? The Zeniths had an ectogenic chamber aboard the ship. An updated version of the one you found me in. They must have used a stored sample of Elizabeth's DNA. I doubt Elizabeth would have let them take her DNA. Do you know how they got it? That wasn't part of the archive I was allowed to access. The archive? You said you spent years studying in a training interface. Was this archive you mentioned part of that? But only the parts I was permitted to access. Aristotle and Aspasia, the avatars of the archive, would assign me learning modules and evaluate my progress. Wait, those names. They were designed to be the virtual guides for the Apollo database <coughs> before Ted Farrow purged it. The Zeniths have a copy. So it still exists. And you got to learn from it. Only what was deemed pertinent to the mission. If I requested information outside of my parameters, my tutors would deny it. To have all that knowledge just out of reach must have been frustrating. Um, okay, I'll let you rest. All right. I think that's enough for now. <coughs> Do you want to come upstairs or so how long? You know, your, your your plan. How long before Gaius fabricated a machine army to defeat the Zenus? How did you know optimal strategy? So, well, I still have to get two more subordinate functions before Gaius powerful enough to absorb Hephaestus. What? You don't have Hephaestus already? Guy is still figuring out how to capture it. It's not confined to a single- To a single location, of course not! You didn't even know who the Zeniths really are. You were supposed to be further along by now. Coming here was a mistake. They're gonna find me. They're gonna find this place and take me back. This was all for nothing. They're not going to find us. Guy is using Minerva to mask our location. What difference does it make? You're too far behind. We're never going to beat them. Everything. Everyone. I'm going to die. Hey. Calm down. You're here now, right? So is there anything you can do to help? I have certain knowledge sets. And given your state of progress, expertise you probably lack. Geoengineering, of course. Computer science, physics, biology, chemistry. Okay. Well, That's... That's good. See if you can do something with that. Talk to Gaia. I'll check on you later. Damn, I kind of feel bad for her, man. She's freaking out. Know. Her injury's not that bad, but I think she regrets coming here. <clears throat> Feeling might be mutual. Hmm. I'll come back later and talk to her. See if I can learn anything. Poor girl. I should get the weapon fragment to Gaia. Well, this definitely should be an interesting conversation with Gaia. Where is, where is Gaia? This way. <laughs> All right, let's go.